Hi Taurus, what's going on tonight? October the 6th, 2019. So this reading, I am doing it at 10 minutes to 10, October the 6th at night, East Coast. So hello out there, everybody. So this is your reading from October the 6th to December the 31st. And I asked the angels, um, what is it that they, what is going on with Taurus? I'm just picking up something the spirit wants me to, to uh, do you. So I'm burning my incense and I want you to know what it is. It's Champa. And I got it at the dollar store for $1.29. And it's really, really good. The spirits, when I do my reading, the spirits love this smell. It's so sweet. So sweet. And I'm doing the Romance Angel cards. And these are my cards. They're 20 years old. I got a new deck, but I love these. Okay. So let's see what is going on with Taurus. I'm just so curious. Um, Taurus. Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. Is this what's been going on, Taurus? You want to reconcile with somebody or somebody's going to reconcile with you this month? I, I swear to God, I feel this happening October, November, December. Somebody's coming back. Um, they have Aries, Cancer. Uh, either a fire sign, a water sign, earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Aquarius. I swear to God, I feel like a couple people are coming back. And, and I feel that's what's on your mind. Taurus, are you missing someone? I kind of feel it a little bit. Watch when you reconcile because there was deception there with this person. There was deception there, Taurus. Uh, this woman was talking to two men or this woman, man was talking to two women. Everybody's wearing a false fat fucking mask. This whole thing. Um, the universe is saying, the angels are saying that open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. It's okay for you to love again. Don't let one bad apple or a few bad apples, you know, spoil you uh, meeting someone new, um, dating someone new. Don't let that happen. A lot of you are thinking very hard. Um... A lot of you have had a past life with this person that wants to come back or you have in your heart that you miss them and you might want to go back. But there was some trust issues there, Taurus. I feel like this is really laying heavy on your heart. You can be mad all you want. Seriously, you can be mad all you want, but there's some heaviness there. Seriously. You guys were supposed to get married. Some of you were supposed to get married. What happened? They still feel like you're worth waiting for. They miss you. And if you're to reconcile or get back together with them or even have passion with them, the sex is going to be hot and steamy. Let me do a couple more angel cards. Yeah, they want to have sex with you again. They want to make love to you. They're horny. They haven't had sex. Believe me, they... Believe me. They want a bad. There was some... You know, Taurus does something to a man or a woman. With sexual... With their sex. It's like their shit is made out of gold. Oh, angels, what is it that you want Taurus to know? What are they feeling? So Taurus, so the universe gave me three cards um, of the of the uh, romance angels. Taurus, you have to forgive. No matter if you reconcile with this person, a night of passion, or whatever you're going to do with them, you have to forgive. And you're, I'm sorry, but you're going to have to make an effort too. He's going to make an effort. He or she is going to make an effort. They're going to reach out to you. 
And they want you to give your relationship a chance. They want to get back together with you. Very much so. So let's see what these cards have to say. The lovers. There's a separation between you two. Very much so. You got the three of cups. You have some um, healing to do, Taurus, from this. A lot of healing you need done. Um, you got the Ace of Swords. This is a very difficult time for Taurus. Because they're so used to this person being in their life. Doesn't matter how mad you are, Taurus. I'm telling the truth. The world. This is what's heavy on your heart. This is what's heavy on your mind. You can't change that shit for nobody. And don't let nobody dictate to you. You know? You're a perfectionist in this relationship. And you wanted recognition, recognition in this relationship, Taurus. But then the devil stepped in. Don't self-punish yourself because of this relationship that ended. You weren't really happy in this relationship. Um... Nine of Cups. There was up. There was differences and disputes in this relationship, and a lot of mistakes. That's why you guys are not together now. Uh, the Sun. There was. You felt lonely in this relationship. I always say you could be married, or you can be living with someone in a relationship, living in different places. You could still be lonely. And the engagement was broke off, or the marriage. You canceled the plans. But the Ten of Cups is showing. You could be happy again. The Ten of Cups. This is what's heavy on your heart. Could you be happy? Could things work out? Yeah, they could. If you guys put an effort to it, it can work out. Um, You got the Ten of Wands. You feel like this person was a traitor. Treachery. You feel like you lost a lot of money with this person, a lot of, a lot of, whatever it is. You feel like you lost it. Ah, uh, you got the six of coins. With the six of coins, he always wanted something, or she always wanted something. Always wanted favors. Ah, uh, nine of swords. You had your suspicion. You had your doubt in the relationship. This person had a shady character. You had reasonable fear. You're doing a transformation now. You're cleaning away all that bullshit. Watch the uh, Taurus as you don't get sick. You're worried about your financial security. That That's the thing you're most important right now. You're working, you know, you're working on your money. You're working on you since the breakup. You, you felt like you were overkind to this person. You felt like a fool. Magician. This person could sell you anything they're very trickery that you were with the moon yeah there was a lot of double dealing in this relationship somebody was being taken advantage of you had to use your caution yeah this person lied a lot and it could be any sign queen of swords this person was very malicious that you were with very fucking deceitful and they were either bipolar there was something wrong with their mind and they know it. Ace of coins. But you got material now. You got the spiritual prosperity. The universe is... Ever since this breakup, you've been getting everything you wanted. Not to say that you're fully happy, Taurus. But your life has changed since the breakup. The four of cups. See, he's he or you are just letting shit go. You've had a bitter experience from it. You were not happy. You were disgusted by this person, whatever they've done. Um, you got the Ten of Coins. It was almost like a game of chance with this person. They did steal from you. Absolutely. Absolutely. They, they done stole from you, uh, Taurus. But now he wants to come back. He or she wants to come back now with the Page of Cups. They want to offer you a new relationship. They want to offer you a new love. 
They want to offer you everything new. And they're coming back between October, November, December. And I said this before. Oh, the Four of Wands. They want romance. They want sex. They want some coochie coochie. Or you want some penis. Or you both want the same thing. Five of Wands. Somebody, there's an indecision still here, Taurus, with you. Because some of you want to go back and then some of you don't. You see what I'm saying? But that's your decision. Can't nobody make shit for you. You have to make it on your own. This is your life. This ain't nobody else's life. People can have fucking opinions all day. But if that's not what you want to do, then fine. If it is, that's your life. But they used you for their personal gain. I want you to know that. And then you've got the Five of Cups. Yep, return of an old friend reunion. They're coming back. Now, Taurus, I said this before in a video, you could have two to three people coming back. And these people are coming back with a vengeance, a good vengeance. They want you back, and they and they um have a hopeful outlook on this, too. They want you back between October, November, and December. It's just not one baby. It's one to three or one to four. Uh, Ace of Swords, because uh, Taurus has this thing sexually. Taurus are freaky. Taurus are passionate, romantic. And once they lay that shit on you, child, it, it starts from a kiss, and there you go. Um, Ace of Swords. Now, this person you were dealing with had a violent temper deep down inside. They didn't show you everything. You only saw a little bit, but they do have a temper. You were embarrassed by this person because they made you look like a foe. You felt like a fool. Isn't that what love's about sometimes? The Eight of Wands. There was thorns to dispute. This person was very jealous of you. They did harass you to a certain extent. There was a lot, a lot of fucking quarrels. Seven of Cups. The mama was right in the middle of it. Or the grandmother. Mama or grandmama. Uh, the Queen of Wands. I'm telling you, this person was jealous of you and deceitful. Oh, my Lord. And cheated. If he didn't cheat physically, he was he or she was calling people on the phone and talking to them. And their e emotions were unstable. They were fickle. Okay? You got the Two of Swords, uh, Taurus. You're very firm. And when you're a firm and you say what you mean, you mean what you say. You felt like this person was a stalemate. Like, fuck that. You know? I'm not going to keep putting up with this bullshit. No, I'm not. I'm not going to keep putting up with the bullshit. You want a truce. You want them to apologize. You want truce. Three of Wands. This card's let me know some of you are psychic on YouTube. You have psychic abilities. You know. You know this shit. What I'm telling you is true. Knight of Coins. Some of you are at a standstill right now. Some of you are in a lack of direction. You don't know whether to take this fool back or stay. The Temperance. Disunion. You're not together. There's always conflict of interest. Right now, Taurus, you're a loner. You're not seeing anybody. You're not talking to nobody. Some of you are not. You're still broken hearted. Because they left you or you left them. You still don't understand this person. They don't understand you. But that doesn't mean that you don't love each other. You can love each other and still not be together. Um, Taurus, you got the Six of Swords. Right now, there's no immediate solution to the present difficulty. You need a confession. You want them to confess to you of what the fuck they were doing. Knight of Wands. This person that you were dealing with is char changing residency and they might want you to move in with them or come back to them. The Empress. You're very fertile at this time. Uh, judgment. Some of you have been separated for a month or two. Could be longer than that. You have sex, bam, you're pregnant. Um, judgment. You're very frustrated by this. Because if they did ghost you, you want to know why. Like, what the fuck was wrong with you? You know? Are they, you ghosted them. They want to know. But they did steal from you. They were taken from you. And you know that shit is true. Uh, Page of Swords. There was dangers around them because they were plotting. 
if their mind wasn't right. They could be bipolar. And you never, you just never know what they were going to do. Then, Taurus, you have the falling tower. They're not going to change. They're going to still do the same bullshit that they're doing. Uh, the Ace of Swords. But that's something that you have to find out. It's a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Airy, Leo, Sagittarius. Aquarius. Could be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, too. It could be any sign. It's going to start off as a false start. You want them to prove your, prove themselves if you're going to get back with them. The Ace of Cups. Universes, I'm telling you, since you left this person, the universe has just been so good to you. And the universe has continued to be good to you. The universe really doesn't want this person back in your life. I'm going to tell you that shit now. The hangman. The universe is what held you back, Taurus. They didn't want you to be with this person anymore. The hangman. They're not going to... Some of them are not even going to make an effort. Because they're afraid. They don't know what you're going to say. This other person does have a very bad ego. Okay. Very much so. And the four swords. You're guarding yourself. You're guarding your heart. You're guarding yourself. They want to recover what is lost. They want to recover you. Does that make sense to you? They'll fight anybody that gets in your that stands in their way. They want the victory. And here you are in their life. You are their queen. And the three of swords. The three of swords. The three of swords is um you have a lot of you have a lot of sorrow and dis and disappointment. And you are separated. The card does say that again. Some of you are very unhappy and have a lot of grief going on. Uh, the the Knight of Cups. Um, this person was a sly and cunning person. You can't trust them. This person was capable of swindling anybody. Do you hear me? It doesn't matter what sign. But you have strength over this situation. You had strength over this situation. And then you got the Four of Coins. Taurus, you love to spend money. Start saving your money. That's including me. I'm Taurus. The fool. Uh, some of you are starting a new job or going to school, but there's unlimited possibilities. Taurus, you're doing so much. Not only are you working school, you could be doing, um, you could be helping people that's less fortunate. I mean, you got so much going on in your families. Then you got the Ten of Swords. Um, this person took advantage of you. And here he stands out in your life. I'm sorry, guys. This could be a woman, too. I'm just saying him, him, him. But Taurus men, this could be your ex could be a woman, too. Everything I'm saying, just reverse it, okay? A lot of this is coming out for the man, for the woman about the man. So the king of wands. This man that you were dealing with was very intelligent. He was a father. He was married before. Um... Maturity? No, this person was not mature at all. Almost like a little kid, like um, their mind was not like fully developed, even though that they were the age that they are. No, they were not honest, period. Everything that come out their mouth was a lie. They turned shit around like an, an artistic behavior. Seven of Swords. But you're making new plans. Some of you are moving on. You say, fuck that, I ain't going back. Seven of Coins. You got a lot of anxiety about this. Um, you guys lost a lot of money dealing with this foe. Six of Wands. You got good news coming in. You got a promotion coming in. Right now, I think Taurus is from this breakup. You're worried about your job right now and your stability and your financial issues. But Taurus, you do have somebody new coming in uh, October, November, December. It's a Gemini. Aquarius uh, could be reconciled with an, with an Aquarius or a Virgo. Yeah. Or Cancer. Six of Cups. There's going to be a lot of coming events. You guys are going to be going out. You're going to be doing you for real. Uh, you got the Three of Coins. Some of you do have the money problems right now. Um, you're preoccupied, like I say, with your job. Making that money. You got the Justice. 
Uh, this person has made false accusations about you uh, to your face and will tell you. And it's just as full of shit as they're telling you. You got the two of cups. Yeah. Beginning or renewed. They want to come back. They want to come back. They love you. I can't say that this person does not love you, Taurus, because they do. And they want the engagement to go on. They want the marriage to go on. They want the partnership to go on. He's giving you his cup. He wants to make up with you. Now, whether you do Taurus or not, that's on you. Uh, King of Cups. Once again, this person is double dealing, dishonesty, thief. Um, created a scandal within your relationship. Uh, the Five of Cups. Since all that bad shit was going on, now new shit is coming in. You got new interest in matters. You know, you're overcoming shit. You know? And that's good, Taurus. You got the Five of Swords. Um, I feel like someone's going to pass around you, Taurus, entertainment purposes only. This person wants to seduce you. Uh, you got the Two of Coins. You're going to get a, some type of letter, message from them, text, phone call, whatever. Um, you got the Nine of Coins because they can't get you off of their mind. They can't sleep at night either. They think about you constantly. They follow you on social media. If they got a car, they might drive past your house. You don't know what the fuck they're doing. Um, you got the Nine of Coins. Watch your safety, though, because some of them are crazy. Okay? If you do go back to them, watch your treasured, treasured possessions because them fuckers steal some of them. Queen of Coins. You got everything you want. You got luxury in your house. You got everything you want. You're a rich person inside. You understand? You're very charitable. Help anybody. You got the two of wands. Some of you are sad and troubled about this breakup. Yeah, some of you are troubled. Uh, you got the eight of, eight of coins. This person was very lazy that you were with. Ooh, very conceited too, honey. Very. Didn't have no fucking ambition at all. My dog had more amb ambition than they did, or my cat. Eight of cups. Um, your holidays look really good. I do feel you're going to meet somebody. Either you're talking to somebody now and you're getting to know, I feel like you've been talking just not now. Um, but if you haven't met them, you're getting ready to meet them between October, November, and December. Your holidays are going to be great. Um, Knight of Swords, you got somebody new coming in, Taurus. You really do. Um, now your decision is. Some of you are going to go with this new person and some of you are not. Don't go back to that old shit, I'm telling you, because it's not going to work. But then some of you feel that the relationship will work. Um, you got to do what fits you, Taurus. I'm going to pull a couple more cards from the Romance Angels. Angels, what is it that you want Taurus to know? What is it that you want Taurus to know? What is it that you want Taurus to know? What is it that you, what's laying on Taurus's heart? Taurus, you do have to let go of control issues. You can hear me shuffling. What is it that you want Taurus to know, Romantic Angels? Taurus, you got bad control issues. And Taurus, also, you got to be more playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine, which is true. Uh, angels, what do you want Taurus to know, Angels? Taurus, you lose yourself. you got to love yourself first. You've been loving other people for so long. That you forgot how to love yourself. And that's very true. Uh, what is it that angels you want Taurus to know? This one flipped out. You got to express your love. Express your love more Taurus. Some of you men, Taurus men hold in your love. Some of you Taurus women hold in your love. You got to express it more. Let it out more. If you want a relationship to work. Romance angels. What is it that you want Taurus to know? So these are the last ones that I'm pulling. Um, you have to flirt more. With some of you flirt a lot, too much. They want you to stay optimistic about your love life because someone either you're going to reconcile or someone new is coming back in. Romantic feelings. If this ex does uh, reappear, um, your romantic feelings are still going to be there. You know, you can have romantic feelings. You can love somebody from afar. But... You know, Taurus, if you let them back into your life, how is your life going to be? If you didn't trust them then, do you think that you're going to trust them now? That's the, that's the question that you have to answer for me. 
if you let your ex back in, are you going to trust them? What is it? I mean, what is it that you're going to do? You know what I'm saying? So you have to look back at the relationship that you had with this man or this woman and say, hmm, if I let them in, are they going to do the same shit to me? Because if they stole from you and they lied to you and they were talking to other people, do you actually think with one or two months or a few months or a few weeks that they actually changed? No, you're going to have to make that motherfucker show you that they have changed. Seriously. You're going to have to make them show you that they've changed. You cannot go by and what a person tells you. A person can tell you anything. The actions show better than anything. Okay, Taurus? So whatever decision that you make, God bless you. Um, I hope you make the right decision. Don't make a foolish decision. Think about it before you get back in with an ex. An ex is an ex for a reason. If you would like a reading, you could call me at 313-401-3707. I prefer you to text me. Um, emergency readings are 90. Um tarot cards are 55 and phone readings are 65 okay so and one question is 15 dollars, and you would go through my paypal so everything is in my bio that you need if for some reason you can't get through on paypal or something goes wrong you can always text me okay but i do not answer any questions for free okay um, this video is not going to resonate with everyone because i read for millions of people in and out of the united states if it resonates with you, that's wonderful. I'm happy. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. That is very important, Taurus. Cross watchers, thank you for watching. Maybe you got Taurus in your chart, cross watchers, or you with a Taurus. And this might give you some insight. So God bless you.